Hey, welcome to Briggs Our Toys. I'm doing something unprecedented. I'm doing, this is my third live stream today, on, but it's on three different channels. We've been to Briggs Our, where we started. Hey, Lego Freak, you've made all three. And we've been to Trains Our, where I lost my sig fig, so this is uh, this one. And here's Carl. for a, We're going to do a haul video. And I, uh, I went to Six Flags last week, and we filmed some videos with Thomas. Not this Thomas, but another Thomas. But this is my Six Flags Thomas. We went to Six Flags and rode the Georgia Cyclone, a roller coaster for the last time. I filmed uh, some footage. I didn't do any on-camera or on-ride camera footage because I didn't bring the camera that I can sneak on there because they don't allow you to film stuff uh, unless you're, you get permission, special permission or something. But... Uh, so I didn't get any own ride views, but I've filmed some in the past. But we wanted to ride it one last time, and I took Thomas with me as well. So I got a video. Um, don't know if I'm, I, I was going to put it here on this channel, just kind of a because we uh, they might be bricks is wanting to do a video. He thinks that it's going to be a Rocky Mountain construction rebuild of the Georgia Cyclone. But that's not why you're here. You're here because uh, you probably were on the Trains Are Fun live stream or the <laughs> Freaks Are live stream, and now you're here. And I told you I was going to come over here. And so that's most of you guys were already over there and gals and whatever. We got Matt the Gamer Train. We got um, Jody Smith, Steve O. Johnson, who was over there. The Biscuit Man <laughs> is here. <laughs> that's a funny tra ch channel name. Uh, Tar Tanker Video, Mighty Bricks, Sonya T. So we got a lot of people that were indeed over there on Trains Are Fun, Diesel Rail Car Productions. And Diesel, oh. Diesel Rail Car Production actually asked a very good question. It's not related technically to this video, but he asked, what are your thoughts on Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? I like the music in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Uh, I do prefer Willy Wonka, the, uh, the one with Gene Wilder, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. But Charlie and Chocolate Factory is more accurate to the book in a lot of ways. But Johnny Depp was very weird in that movie, so I don't know. All right, so we're going to do a haul. Actually, let's start with this one. This is from Toys R Us, and this is something. I just gave a sneak peek of some of this. Uh-oh, where did I set it? Did I leave it over there? Or is everything in here? Oh, yeah, it's all here. Now, this is for Trains Are Fun, but these are out at... Um, over there, the Steelworks, Hurricane, we got Merlin, actually that's Thomas, <laughs> and this is Merlin. So that's for my Trains Are Fun video, and I also picked up Merlin the Invisible. So if you've never watched Trains Are Fun, and uh, probably most of you have, but um, I'm going to be doing giveaways in upcoming videos over there of these three items. So we did a giveaway of a Bachman Oliver train over there, and I'm going to be doing that giveaway. So that was from Toys R Us. Now we're going to do the eBay and Amazon stuff. And the reason I'm doing it here is because I don't know which things are Lego and which things aren't. And um, I just thought I'd do it here on my toys channel uh, because I just want to do it that way. All right. This is from eBay. And I thought this might work on my Brickzar channel with Stranger Bricks. And... Um, I also might work with uh, telling people, don't ship, don't ship a set in a, pa a, a packing envelope. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Envelope box. Box smashed. Ugh. I can just throw the box around now. Uh-oh. I, I need to go get it. Hold on. So much for that. All right. That's right, Diesel. Diesel Rail Car Production. Boxes should go in boxes. I'm tired of these people on eBay who don't know that. Ugh. It's okay to pack, like, Lego pieces or even if you... But this, this thing was not smashed in the picture. It was not... Look at it. It's, of course, you know what? Why am I complaining? I was going to open it, but it, it still makes me mad. So, hey, Mardi Gras man's over here. Appreciate it. And, uh, hey, yeah, everybody's at Troublesome Junction and says, I hate it. 
Lil and Fife says stupid eBay people. Yeah. Don't get mad. Dad, don't get mad. <laughs> uh, you know, I got to go back and look. You know, the picture, and it's my own fault. I mean, his picture quality wasn't good, but um, it was a very good price <laughs> for an exclusive item. And I was going to uh, um, open it anyway. So, But this is from Lego Day at AT&T Park. It's in San Francisco. This is Lucille. Lucille, I get it. It's like Lucille. <laughs> and this was the giveaway. It's an exclusive item. Uh, the Boston Red Sox version is really expensive. This one it was really cheap. So I got it for a good price. Next, I should have bought all four that he had. That way uh, one of them might not have been smashed. But this... This video wasn't supposed to be a rant video, so I'm, I'm glad. I'm, I'm just want to say I'm really glad that I did not do this on Trains Are Fun because I would have freaked out all the kids when I got upset. I apologize for getting upset. I'm not really upset. I'm just uh, being overly dramatic for YouTube effect. Um, yeah, but no, I am mad. Donald and Douglas is here. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> Oh, there's so many people here. <laughs> yeah. Shadow subset 5501, comment of the minute. eBay, one star rating by Briggsar Toys. That's right. <laughs> Very good, man. Thank you so much. Um, so these were given out at a special event at the AT&T Park in San Francisco. Oh... But you know what? He did give me a handwritten note. I'm going to save it. All right. Here we go. Let's go to... All right, enough of that. And technically, I should not be bad because it's... it's I got it really cheap, and I am going to open it, which pretty much decreases the value anyway as far as the box, but... Uh, and, I, and I probably would flatten the box. <laughs> oh, well. All right. So, uh, let's see what's in this bag here. Oh, you're going to like this. I think you're going to like this one. Oh, man. All right. So, Stranger Bricks is over a series I'm going to try to do at least once a week. Uh, just depends on my schedule. Do a video of weird Lego stuff. Check it out. <laughs> I got the shirt. I got the shirt. That creepy minifigure. All right, so this was for Kids Fest 2013, which was in all those areas. Not in Georgia. <laughs> it's the face shirt. It's a little bit too big for Yoda, but I may put it on Yoda anyway. So that was what we got there. It was, And it was only like six dollars so not a bad deal oh yeah uh, oh, did, oh hold on a minute is there an a fault oh yeah oh god block all right <laughs> uh oh did i ban the wrong person hold on a minute Hold on a minute. I may have accidentally blocked somebody. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thank you, Marty Grammy. <laughs> um, in, in, in case some of you don't know, uh, I am a person that draws out the... Um, the uh, fake accounts out there. So uh, that was not the real AFAL man, by the way. Right. And I know that because he was watching. All right, next up is Rosie. So remember, I said I was going to do a Rosie giveaway. I got another Rosie. So that's for Trains Are Fun. And then we got this box. Oh, this is going to scare me. All right. 
Hold on. Do you remember the Brick Czar live stream? Any of those that were over there? This bet I only got this is the only package left. How do I open this? I need the cutters. I think I may have accidentally blocked somebody that didn't need to be blocked, but... Um, oh no, that's not it. I am missing a package. Oh. Dag nabbit. Alright, so... All I got was Gordon's Tinder. I am going to be really, really mad if there's not other stuff. I'm going to be really... I'm about to... This, I did not buy Gordon's Tinder. <laughs> this is not a good day for the, the world of eBay auctions. But this... We can make up for it all right now. For your viewing enjoyment. Thank you for your eBay order. Okay, again. Envelope. Box. Envelope. Box. Not what I ordered. <laughs> box. This is the... I did not order just a tender. <laughs> All right, so they, uh, this one here, they said that uh, they left this part out, and so they shipped it separately. But so far, all I've got to show for my order is this. If the other stuff does not come, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be talking to eBay. But hopefully, the other stuff will come. Obviously, the other stuff that goes with this. Uh, I am this is this not been a good video. All right, but this is going to make up for it. Even though they shipped this in a box. Okay. I did, what are the odds of this? Three things wrong on three eBay auctions. This was from Amazon, so it doesn't count. Okay, this eBay auction was good though. This one's good. I need to get Yoda to wear that. Uh, I think it's too big for him. All right, this is. Um, <laughs> I got this for the uh, English. <laughs> this is Star Wars The Force Awakens Train Track The most fashion The most shiny The most charming Play and fun May the best collection gifts for children May be the best collection gifts for children So parents If you have not bought this for your child What is wrong with you? New fashion items mixed. Who knew that Star Wars was all about fashion and being the most shiny and the most charming? All right. Maybe the best collection gifts for children. Train track. The other one I had, it said gifts. Freedom of assembly. So you can get together and build this. Made in China. Probably, totally rip off of the Star Wars franchise here because uh, China does not seem to care. It's a knockoff. So I'm pretty sure it's a knockoff. Although they, I'm surprised they use that there. But um, yeah, it's a train for children that was shipped in a box. I mean, an envelope. Oh, look at this. You get a, a fancy... thing's glued. Oh, it's just for the background. It's like glued to the box. I can't even take it out. It's just for the backdrop. I'll take it out anyway. There we go. Alright, so we have the... Kylo Ren <laughs> and Ray train. That is pitiful. We have the R2-D2 and BB-8. 
I think that's a tender for this. Yeah. We have the Millennium Falcon. Wait a minute. That looks like a tender. He's got a double tender. Wait a minute. What? Maybe this goes like that. I, was he the Flying Scotsman? I don't know what this is. And then we got the um, <laughs> Thin and Chewbacca caboose that you got to put on backwards because of the way the things are done. Awesome. Wow. This is crazy. The um, which is worth more, the box or the set? I think it's the um, the box. He said this uh, sin killer set. Uh oh, hold on a minute. I'm about to accidentally delete somebody. Uh, the particular set has a million variants on AliExpress. Very common mold. They just ch yes. In fact, we did we did buy another. Um, we did buy another one of these. And it was basically the same thing. They just throw different stickers on there and have a different color. Um. <laughs> why waste your money on knockoffs? Because I get to show you why you shouldn't buy them, and I get to rant. That's why. <laughs> I keep hitting the wrong button. <laughs> All right, kill it with fire. So, um, but you know what? The track, even though it's, if this is garbage too, it actually works with uh, Thomas and Friends minis. So, see that? It can actually work with the minis. So, that's all. But, um, yeah, this one doesn't have as much English as I had hoped. See if I missed anything. I like the freedom of assembly. Not suitable for children under three years due to small parts. Uh, tested in accordance with international standards. Please keep all the relevant information for future reference. Specification colors and contents may vary from the illustration. Look at that. They even they put the caboose in the middle of the train. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> Kill the train. I'll probably drop a refrigerator on it. So uh, we've been... I got a refrigerator and a piano I need to get rid of. So this will probably be one of those things that gets smashed. So that's what we'll do. Oh, he said compare it to the Bradford Exchange Star Wars train. <laughs> Already gone, man. That's a good one. That's what we should do. We should compare it. So that'll be upcoming video. We, we'll probably do a comparison and then the smash. We'll smash it with a refrigerator or a piano, depending on which one's left. All right, so, man, that ended up being a rant haul. Didn't expect that to happen. If I don't get the rest of my Gordon, I'm going to be very, 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 very ranty. So stay tuned for that as well. But, yeah, they probably couldn't tell it was a caboose. That's what Sinkiller said. It's like they're, they're, and these are like two tenders. They're both tenders. They're not even... It's, they're not even cars. I mean, that's not that's not a gondola. That's a tender. And that's a, definitely a tender. So, and then they put the caboose in the middle of the train. So, it's like, it is Chinese. Come on, people. All right. That's enough of that. I'm really disappointed in this one. But uh, thank you guys for being here. And uh, I, if this, the rest of Gordon doesn't come, I will file a claim. I've never, ever had to do that. And... Um, it's just a sneaky thing. I don't I, I don't have any reason to believe that the seller is trying to scam me, but it is kind of suspicious because he can get the proof of shipping uh, that he shipped it by shipping just that, and then all the valuable stuff doesn't come. So uh, we will see what happens. All right. See you guys. I will, uh, I'm done for tonight, but until next time, this is Briggs Art Toys. Bye.